admin preferences. General tab. All explanations are written here. A starting day of week refers to your weekly reports. For some projects, it is Wednesday, some are Friday, and so on. But in calendar lesson, we suppose that our start date is Monday. Activity duration. When you insert a new activity, it is shown in origin duration column. From this part, you can change it. Data limits is default. We don't change it and so these tabs. Time periods. We have specified working hours in calendar section. All other tabs are default. And we have talked about industry tab in setting of section. Admin categories. In admin categories, all tabs are default. We don't change them. In units of measure tab, it is clear from its name. But let me give you an example. We have concreting. The measurement you need for concrete is cubic meters. We can add it in this section. Currencies. I want to explain the section with an example. The contract is in dollars, but the currency is in tomats. You spend it in tomats, right? I add one currency as tomat. The base currency. What is written in contract is US dollar. So, it is selected. Exchange rate. It says, what is the exchange of tomans down to the baseline currency? Here is US dollar, right? The baseline currency here is US dollar. One dollar is equal to 4.2 tomans. Now, suppose that our contract rate and the currency rate is the same. It is in tomans. So, this exchange rate is 1. And the base must be changed into tomans, not dollars. So, as you see, it is not possible to change it. Just change base currency, ID name, and symbol. Instead of US dollar, write toman, and so on. Then, from Edit User Preferences, select a currency. You see, nothing is changed. Just a symbol is changed. Because exchange rate is 1. If it is 4.2, you see, the numbers are changed according to the exchange rate. 